Hey y'alls, this is Salmon Rambly, and I am desperately playing Goner in hopes to make it to the third boss. This is actually, I think, now my fifth video, trying to get to some semblance of progress, but for whatever reason, I have been unable to do so. I could blame the game for becoming harder, but I think I'm just getting sloppy. I'm a one and done kind of guy, looks like. But that's okay, we're still going to try because I need to get over this nasty habit of mine and just move forward. I wonder why I never get points on that first stage. I see that as an error in the game. Terrible. Negative 0.5 for that. I don't really review games that way. If a game's like a 10 or a really solid game, I'll like rate it that way. Say like if this game was a 10, what well, would reduce points and there are certain things that will do that. I look, look at Mario, and it really was just the surplus of power moons that you could get. Because it was ridiculous at the end. You'd sneeze and you'd get a power moon at some point. I know that the game wasn't meant to be 100%ed, or if it was, it was totally voluntary. It wasn't like super encouraged. But I don't know. My completionist mindset means you have to experience the entire game nothing should be considered extra or superfluous that everything should be well designed that may be unrealistic of me but i don't know i was the guy that played super mario galaxy two times through getting 120 stars or whatever this the star counter or whatever they used was at the time and i i fully completed it and i loved it all I would give that game a 10 out of a 10 based on my current scale. Oh. Let's kill some more people. I didn't get enough of my anger out. So when something like Mario came around, or Mario Odyssey did, and it had absolutely amazing ideas, I giggled like a schoolchild at some of the concepts. But see that it was watered down with all these extra stars from mini games or pounding on the ground or those stupid hint art pictures. God, I hate those. Then it could have been a 10 out of 10 for me. It gave it a 9.5, so that's not a huge difference. But say that me. I don't know how that comment has anything to do with what I was talking about, but we're gonna keep it. With Goner, Goner is not a game that immediately screams 10 out of 10. Uh, maybe it could be improved to be able to get that kind of score. Um, and like I say, certain games can be improved to reach true masterpieces, and some games can't. Um, what's with your face, dude? Were you scared by the, the combo? God, who knows? You look at, I'm trying to give a good example here games that could not possibly get to a 10 out of 10 based on their inherent game design. Space Cats with lasers. There we go. That's a good one. I think it could be made into a solid like 7 game, but its basic premise is just a Geometry Wars ripoff. And so if it were ever to reach it like a 10 out of 10, it'd just basically be Geometry Wars and done very well. With Ghana right now, it's sitting around an 8. Maybe it could be an 8.5, maybe it's a 7.5. It really, it really is based on whether it continues to be good as you progress. I like every a lot of things about it. Again, I'll give top marks to the sound and art direction. But the more I play, the more I'm annoyed by certain things. I think I mentioned in my last video about the invincibility aspect that I want a little bit of time between hits have time to recoup and get away. One of the other things that has been really bothering me is that my character sometimes seems like he has a hard time aiming, or it's not as precise as I'd like it to be. I'll be aiming in one direction, um, or think I'm aiming, but I'm actually aiming in the opposite direction because this shotgun has such a huge recoil, it often results in me being damaged. Again, this could probably be my own fault because I am not being careful enough, but it's happened quite a few times, so I don't know if it is my fault. <laughs> Again, that's not, that's not a very good review argument right there. It's like, 
I mess up enough times, so it must be the game's fault. Eh, that can be used in some arguments, but not necessarily everything. Now, Spelunker, I'll use that argument on. That game sucks, even if I die atrociously almost every time I play it. Uh, this is my little hidey hole. Take a breather. I don't know if I want to go this way. Let's go away the long way. Get a few extra kills. I don't know if I can reach that long. Let's try one more time. Nope. We did not pass the long jump test. God, what I wish for vertical shooting right now. Bam. Maybe that could be a gripe. So I really do wish there was some vertical shooting aspect to it. What I really enjoy is when this game gets intense and I'm killing enemies left and right. That's exciting to me. So if I was able to shoot up, my just barrage of killing would be really cool. But relegated to being only sideways, it's, it kind of slows down the game. I imagine those who are really good can see how they can bounce off enemies and ultimately huh, get everybody on screen, but I'm not seeing that here. I do wonder with this part of the game if there's a reward for killing all the enemies and then going down a secret anus worm. I imagine there is, but I haven't ever been able to kill all the enemies because they're too high. Ooh, that was a close dodge. That wasn't a dodge, that was just luck. That's right. You fought me and I won. Oof. Jeez. I am blessed by luck right now. I'm attacking you from afar. Oh, that, that totally hit me. But, that's okay. Let's move on. That's a lot of purple things. I'm very excited about the number of purple things. Let's just continue. The only downside to recording a lot of times is you forget what jokes you've already made. And so if you repeat them and it was in one of the videos you published, then you just look like an idiot that doesn't have a lot of creativity. I don't think that'll be a problem with me, considering I lack creativity to begin with, but that's the risk you run into. I forgot that he spawned things even after the last video I said, oh, to remember that they spawned things. Took one damage. That's okay. Oh, don't focus on the purple things. It'll be underneath you. Do that again. Yeah, that like that. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Keep making noises. Oh. Come on. Oh no. <laughs> I cheated. Run. Yes, I have four full rows. One day, I'll be able to beat that giant cow without losing all my hearts. For the time being, I am satisfied with my lack of power. I'm sorry, whale. I don't progress in the game. I don't really know if I should, though. It seems like it's making you actually unhealthier. Like this is some type of game that pulls a twist and it's like, oh, you were actually hurting your friend all along. Do the braid way of things. Spoiler alert, if you didn't know, that's how braid ended. It didn't really say anything, but let's just face it. If you haven't played braid yet, you're not going to play it now. It's a lot nicer to know that those things aren't going to kill me anymore. It's nifty that they provide little stools for you to jump on. But I don't really see the need for them, at least not yet, unless they reintroduce bottomless pits, in which case I'll be sad. Holy cow, have I not died yet? I feel special. Now, let's just take all that progress and... Oh, keep it living. No, that's not living. Oh, that was so bad for a second. I feared for my life. Okay. Take this nice and easy. Jump, jump, jump. Back up. Okay. Jump, jump, shoot, shoot. This is like the PG-13 version of kid's book. The skeleton goes shoot, shoot, shoot. The enemies go die, die, die. There's so many people down there. Oh, jeez, and I just got hit. Get the snail. Oh, jeez. 
Okay. That guy. Kill him first, maybe? Oh, jeez. Oh. Nope. Somehow that killed me. I lost half my things. Okay, that means that the next continue will take another three. Ideally. Or it's gone. I don't want to have to cheat and play this game off screen and then come back and pretend like I've just magically improved overnight. 5,000 is a good score, though. Oh, how did you miss that guy? Jeez, you missed him again. Okay. Okay, that looks awful down there. This looks just as bad as it was before. And they're all not in sync with each other. Okay. Hit him once. Yes, we're gonna do it the cowardly way. Call me a little pussy bitch. I don't give a shite. Don't know why I censored myself there after I said something pretty inflammatory. Let's use the special. <laughs> that worked. That was exciting. That was nice. Okay. I do want to get that snail this time. Because this may be one of those stages that has the secret entrance. Admittedly, I died at that secret place. But that's okay. Die. Die, snail. Die, little guy. There's a whole nother section. Okay. Let the guy go past. Kill the little guy. And then run. See, when you actually use your special, you can make ground. Salmon has yet to learn that, but one day. Oh, jeez. Die. I definitely cannot die on this specific level, because that means I have to redo it all over again. Okay. I would assume I would have seen the hidden worm by now, if there was one. So let's just keep going. For the best. I theoretically have enough items or enough purple things to get another continue if I am able to judge the system correctly. I think so. Okay. This is a nice, relaxed level. I like it. Let's just keep going this way. You guys are much preferred over the guys that spit. That guy's annoying. But once you hit him, he's nice. Get <gasps> a heart. So nice. Jude! He had moves. Well, we're making good progress at this point. I think we'll get past this level, hopefully. Oh, jeez! Okay. Those guys have a lot more panache in them than I thought. Oh, that was risky. You gotta really stop being so lazy and just expecting them to die. Onions, onions. I don't know why onions make me jump, but that's okay. I think it's safe to assume that the only things that are going to kill me are red. For me to discover that five hours into the game is probably not good for video game playing, but that's okay. That was also very true. Hey there. Whoa, I wanted to get ammo first. I guess you were eager to swallow me. But I'm a slow learner. Okay. Okay, that guy's dead, so that excites me. Let's keep going. Die. Okay, we're making good progress. This is progress. This is the farthest I've been. to the bottom. This is great. Maybe that's the special stages. Oh no. Zen. 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 No, that's not Zen anymore. It was not good to be Zen. It worked at first, but it was a misgiving. Slowly, slowly. Reach the bottom. Okay. This is a secret stage, right? I need to kill all of you. <laughs> okay. I should... I don't know. I don't know if 
I should fight that guy. I feel like I missed something. Should there be like a secret thing I got? I'm just gonna go up here. I hope you all enjoyed watching this. It is just utterly scintillating for me. God, this was a long level. Nope, nothing. Maybe it's just an easier shortcut. If you didn't want to do the other one. Maybe next time if I get this far, I'll just have to avoid that part. That was your special that you're supposed to save, Solomon. Oh, well, that's what I get for trying to overset. And I was right. That means I need a full three rows to continue again, if not more. Thank you, sir, for always being there for me. You should really change your aesthetic to white. It really works. But that doesn't happen. Sorry for being silent there for a second. I have a deep fear of burping while on microphone. So I held it in with all my might. It hurts, but I did for you all. Now this doesn't look anything like the special stage. That should be okay, I think. But who knows? Hopefully it didn't take me back a whole level. That would royally suck. Jeez. Oh. I'm risking it. I shouldn't do this. Okay, that was bullcrap. I don't see how that happened. Get out of there. Oh, this is not a good start. I know I have way more points than I've ever gotten. But... Okay, that is the secret. So it did bring me back all the way. Son of a gun. I'll just go the normal way. It was a bad idea. Uh... Shit. Language. Okay, keep going. Let there be health on this stage, please. I haven't asked for health in a while. I just want to now die. Oh, there is. The point is I have to get there first. Get... Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> okay, you can stop listening to Solomon go. Starts to sound like a Pokemon there. Okay. Good. I do apologize for my lack of commentary at this moment. This is very stressful for me. I do not have the greatest stress practices. Deep breathing's not a thing. What well, is a thing? But I don't have time for it. Oh, jeez. Okay. The worst enemy is fear itself. Bingo. Please. Intermission. Intermission. Do it. Shop. You got it. <gasps> this doesn't look like it. This looks like it. <gasps> it is. Oh, with a new item, no less. Wise, no, don't go back to the shop. Okay, dude. What's the side? I'm worried. It's gonna kill me. I am a disco rave party. Invincibility? Invincibility. That's my guess. Invincibility. It's taken a long time to reload. I'm gonna try it. There you go. Okay. I'm assuming, because usually when you become multicolored, that means that you're invincible. Or you have gay pride, whichever word, when it is. That joke is too sketchy. I don't care at this point. I will apologize later, but I deeply do if it offended anybody. So, with that out of the way, let's. Oh, jeez! Oh, my God! That's not good. Just run. Oh my god. The turnips are going to be my enemies at this point. Just don't shoot anything. Run, run, run. A little warning would have been nice. Oh my god. We may need the invincibility thing on this. No, they're going after me. No. Go, 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 go. Oh, I can't shoot. Yep, it's invincibility. Run. Ooh, that was frightening. I beat it. Huh. Huh. Okay. Let's go up. This is this is not a good sign, because my whale friend is not. Oh no. What happened? Why? No. What? Huh? What? 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 <sighs> 
confused. I touched the death. Did you kill my friend, death? This seems like a continuation. I'm thinking. I'm, I'm so confused right now. I'm not gonna even pretend that I know what's happening. I'm assuming my whale friend's dead. And that's me pretending I know what's happening, so I went back on my promise earlier. I apologize, everyone. Do these guys keep coming out of the woodwork? I don't know. And I don't know where to go from here. God, they're stealing from so many games. First they had, pa First they had Sonic, now they have Pac-Man. There's gravestones everywhere that are not nice. They create spikes. I know that from my time in the dailies. Where are you going, ghost? Okay, you guys upright and disappear. Okay. We're gonna kill you guys until you give me a purple thing. Who knows? That was that was less of a straightforward stage and more of an open arena. So we're going back to the last black aesthetic. Where oh god, I have nothing. And my item does not have any shoot capabilities. About black aesthetic. A lot more enemies, that's all we know. And that they may be continual. And that there's these ghosts, which are really annoying, that appear out of nowhere and can insta-kill you. I do not have nearly enough purple things to get a continue. Uh, oh, jeez. Okay. Was that the right one to go to? I guess it's opted for more open stages now. Now you have to actively find the exit. Whereas before, you knew if you just went a certain direction, you'd eventually find it. I like that change. I'm excited once more. I also am very afraid. But that is the nature of this game. They still don't stop coming. Theoretically, this is how you can rack up purple things. Just go. Go. Go where it's safe, Solomon. That's nowhere. Nowhere safe. Oh, God. Okay. Well, that was... That was the end. Thank you all for watching my video. I made it. I finally did it. As always, we're going to end with looking at high scores. And my high score, last time was like 700. Now I'm 449. Atta boy. Took me 18 minutes where it took someone else one minute. That is bullcrap. But who knows? Okay. <laughs> well, bye.